Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to another episode of Cooking with Jen. Today, I'm going to show you how to make delightful and fluffy pancake. Pancake is actually a comfort food for everyone, and even children love it. Let's take a look at all the ingredients we require for this lovely pancake. Uh, firstly, we need about 195 grams of plain flour. We need 295 ml of whole milk or reduced fat milk. We need one whole egg. 4 tablespoons of butter, about half a teaspoon of salt. Uh, we need some icing sugar for dusting later, and 2 tablespoons of custard sugar. And of course, we need the vanilla extract. Uh, remember to use natural vanilla extract, not the artificial ones. Measure all your ingredients properly with a weighing machine so that all the quantity will be accurate. And of course, you need a hand mixer. Okay, now we are going to mix all the dry ingredients first together. So I'm going to pour the flour into a mixing bowl, followed by some salt. This half a teaspoon of salt. And we'll leave the icing sugar for later. And we are going to mix the two tablespoons of sugar. Okay, so these are all the dry ingredients. So we're just going to mix everything together. Firstly, I'm actually going to warm the milk uh, on the stove for just one minute to make it slightly warm and then when it's after one minute, I'm going to remove this and pour the milk onto another bowl. And now I'm going to add the melted butter into the milk, followed by Okay, now I'm going to whisk everything together. Basically, we need to whisk it till it's uh, very fluffy and light in colour. And now I'm actually going to make a well in this flour uh, mixture. And after making the well, you see this little hole here. I'm going to pour this egg mixture into the well. And I'm going to slowly stir it until it is no longer lumpy. So you can pour bit by bit, you don't have to pour everything all together. So I'm going to slowly pour the balance. Okay, firstly, uh, we basically need to add mixture until it's very smooth and creamy and there are no longer lumps. And then what we're going to do is to spoon this mixture onto a little pan. Okay, now we are actually waiting for the pancake to be cooked. So it looks like that now. So we'll just wait for about maybe two to three minutes. Okay, one side of the pancake is actually cooked already. So I'm going to actually flip it to the other side so that the other side can be cooked as well. Okay, so basically what you need to achieve is uh, a little bit of a golden brown texture with a little bit of brown uh, texture and, and it's really so I'm going to make the rest now okay now we are on our second pancake so I'm going to flip the other side so I can be cooked yeah so the top part is actually brown so the other side we will just wait for about a minute or so because the pan is now hot so it's easier to cook it. okay our pancakes are done so very nice and golden brown so I am going to actually assemble them with the uh, fruits so we have uh, here lots of fruits, blackberries 
berries, blueberries, and strawberries. So I'm going to place the fruits at the side. Fruits are very high in antioxidants, so um, this is actually a healthier version of the pancake. Okay, now that we're done with uh, assembling the strawberries, we're going to place some blueberries. And we're going to decorate with some blueberries and blackberries. And then we're just going to add some nice icing sugar for decoration. And now that we've finished assembling the strawberries, blackberries, as well as the blueberries, and uh, we have actually put uh, placed some icing sugar on top, so I'm going to use a little bit of honey. Honey is much healthier than maple syrup. Yes. I mean, you can actually put whatever toppings you want. If you like um, ice cream, you can actually use ice cream as well. Vanilla ice cream you eat or any, any other toppings that you know, like. Um, some people like it. Okay, great. This is our lovely pancakes. So, yeah. Have a wonderful Sunday, everyone. Thank you for watching. Thank you.